hi everybody welcome back or welcome to my channel it's your girl diana and i'm back with another video this is a get to know me tag guys the real ones know this is the shirt it's the one <laughs> on every get to know me tag i've worn this shirt the first one which is like three years ago i wore the same shirt and it's three years old that's exactly why it's snake looks like that but i still love it it's good quality it's still in good shape hmm. so i'm gonna be oiling my hair using this okay I don't know how to pronounce it. So I'm going to be oiling my hair, my braids. The mirror is here. And I don't know if I'm going to concentrate. Because I can't concentrate on two things. Let's try. So first thing that you guys have to know about me is my name. My name is Diana K. Kalingu. I don't like the K name. Because it means something really bad. I don't know what my parents were thinking. When just saying, oh, let's, have, let's name her this. But anyways, I... I have a backup name that's actually cute, which is Diana. <laughs> yeah, so Diana is my middle name. My first name is the K1. So you get that much on the lead. And it's green, by the way. You can see when it drops on something, it stands. I've actually sent my pillowcases. Shame. I just four. And then, yeah. So my name's is Diana K. Kaingu. I was born 21st November 2002. In Kawe at the General Hospital, so my grandmother was a nurse at that time. I was born from a teen mom. My mom was like 16 when she had me. Crazy, I know. I'm the first child of five children, four sisters, one brother. Like I said, I was born November 21st, 2002. So I'm going to be 21 on the 21st of November. I completed high school at Kablonga Girls Secondary School, 2019. I have lived most of my life traveling, not like out of the country, but like haven't stayed in one place for more than 10 years. So I was born in Kawe, right? When I was in fifth grade, dad moved further, he got transferred to Siagonga. I have a video, maybe I'm gonna link it up here for story time. Me relocating from Kawe to Siagonga. I went to Siagonga when I was in fifth grade. And then ninth, after I wrote my grade 9 exams, I traveled back to Kawe. I stayed there till I was in grade 11 and then I traveled to Lusaka. I completed my high school in Lusaka at Kablonga Girls, like I mentioned. And then I came here in Monze. I'm currently in Monze, the southern part of Zambia. Am I single? Am I dating? I'm definitely the first thing. <laughs> I'm single. I've been single for like five months now. Am I talking to somebody? No, not yet. Do I want to talk to somebody? Yeah, I do. Am I still broken from my previous relationship? I think I've healed now. I'm fine now. I'm okay. I'm ready to have another man lie to me. <laughs> I'm joking. I don't they play. I'm ready to have another man in my life. Yeah. My previous relationship made me feel like I wouldn't try again, but I'm definitely down for another relationship. Currently doing a little business down here with big scones, muffins, brownies, and yeah, I sell them to the residents of Monzo. I started my YouTube channel in 2019, inspired by my uncle from the Costa, K Nyemba, K Nyemba actually sisters. Stacy Thiru, uh, Chelsea. Chelsea is from Jamaica and she's currently in the United States. She's a mommy. Cute. I aspire to be a business administrator or a procurement officer, an air hostess. Though my parents are against that one because they keep saying, no, it's gonna be hard for you to get a job here in Zambia if you do that. So, no, no, no. But since they're the ones that are paying for now, gonna say okay so i'm currently enrolling into a certain college a roman catholic college yeah i'm gonna be majoring in ict i don't even know how to pronounce it yet but i'm just doing it for the meantime so that i can have a job something going on you know what i'm saying being the first child i need to be at this age i'm supposed to be actually helping my parents with certain views but look at me but anyways gonna get there it's not a race we are in our lane and has a plan for us and as we wait on God's plan we are also pushing A B C D. Closely by tribe. I come from the western part of Zambi. Muzuile Chani, Hande Muzuile Chani, Hande. 
little messy hulu that's how we say good morning thank you so much apparently that's all i know i i am not a friendly friend i'm not a social person i have social anxiety i don't like to be in a crowded place i once like from the time i was born eh? <laughs> went to I've, I've only attended one concert that was when ruga was in the country i think i have a video on my youtube channel you can look it up and trust me i was like ruga ruga <laughs> crazy i was scared At the back of my head i was just like they're gonna kidnap me they're gonna steal me i'm gonna be <laughs> but thank god nothing bad happened i had the best experience will i want to do it again uh, maybe maybe yes maybe no but definitely would love to but just uh, i do ah oh, guys that felt like it's gonna cut i don't have a lot of friends growing up i grew up an indoors girl like my dad never really wanted me to go outside and play with my friends because i was like a notorious child as he says i was very notorious and every time i stepped out of the house i would bring problems people would come knocking at his door like eh, eh, your daughter me i'll beat her because she's done this so to avoid that he always had me locked up in the house he would go for work because i grew up with my dad like i lived with my dad almost my whole life so he would go for work and leave me in the house watching tv if i get tired i sleep he cooked everything for me sometimes he would get me go work with him it was cute it was cool until i i became of age and i knew how to take care of myself yeah. oh my music genre my favorite music genre is afro beats if i am gonna be on a long road trip play me some whiskey play me some rema some omale some ruga i definitely love my country music country music is what bongo flavor bong i don't know what genre our music is zambians zambian music obviously <laughs> but i love zambian music yo much to be particular eh? who else do i love in the zambian industry chef 187 break up with you little mile and this is in the bomba ah naku pele pinti naku pele pinti longa the toy thing ya the cover she bad bad she say wa kupala ma pontini that's it yeah i think i like his sister as well so yeah that's all you guys have to know thank you so much for watching 